Well, that escalated quickly. <laughs> <laughs> we, we were, if you saw last week, last Wednesday's video that we put out, mm -hmm. we were planning on doing a weekly update on our travels, uh, but took a drastic turn and so we're on earlier than planned. Yeah. Uh, you want to tell them what happened? <laughs> we got booted. Boot. We got the boot. We were <laughs> we were in the boot, <laughs> Louisiana, and we got the boot from the we boot. Got the boot. <laughs> well, we were in uh, the Naval Air Station in New Orleans, and we were planning to, to stay the course and just keep going. Yes. Um, and we had not, during our whole whole travels, we had not planned to stay in a lot of military places. But yeah. for some reason, on this leg of our journey, <laughs> most were military they places. Were. Yeah. And so when this deal hit, it all did. the military places started closing. <laughs> and they weren't really closing, they were like, if you're already here, you can stay. Through your stay. Through your stay. You can't extend, extend. And no new people coming in. Yeah. Well, our next stop was in Gulfport at a Naval Air Station. So yeah. we couldn't stop there. Yeah. Then we did have a state park in Mobile. Which we probably can't stay there. <laughs> well, uh, uh, up we as haven't far called, as that, but yeah. I have a feeling we weren't going to get to stay in the state yeah. park anyway. And, but the one after that was a, an Air Force fam camp at Eglin Air Force Base near Fort Walton Beach. And they did call. They called. Both Gulfport and and Fort Walton Beach, uh, Eglin, both called and said, yep. can't sit here. <laughs> Slate's taken. <laughs> you ain't got to go, but you can't stay here. So we couldn't, well, I don't want to say you couldn't. We probably could have found like civilian RV parks, civilian run RV parks to, to go to. Yeah. To, to stay on the course. Um, but after Eglin, we're scheduled to come back to the home area, Columbus, yeah. uh, Fort Benning area. And we were going to kind of surprise everybody and show up yeah. for a veteran uh, a fundraising event yeah. and surprise our friends and our family and kind of, hey, we're here. But um, that didn't work. And since we knew that was several weeks out and it's a military place, yeah, we wanted to get there. And get a spot just in case things get worse and then then they say we're not taking yeah people now they could get to where sorry you did have a reservation yeah. but we're not letting anybody else in so exactly you risk that so we wanted to hurry up and get here we were scheduled to stay in new orleans through tuesday but we went ahead and packed it in uh we called up here to fort benning and they said come on and so we did. So we wanted to, if we were going to get trapped, uh, we wanted to be trapped in a place that was familiar. Yeah. A place that we had like friends no and people. family. A lot of people. Lauren's here. We wanted to be close to Lauren. And so uh, yesterday morning, we packed it up from New Orleans and drove straight through straight. a little over seven hours. Um, so now we're in, um, we're on Fort Benning's campground, but yeah. it's on the Alabama side of the river. <laughs> If that makes any sense. <laughs> so we're in Alabama on Fort Benning, Georgia. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, that tells you how backwoods this place. <laughs> yeah. So we're really, we're really bummed because when we were in, when we were going to go to Gulfport, we were going yeah. to meet up with um, our epic RV it. adventure, yeah. which we didn't get to do. And then when we were going to be in Eglin, we were going to meet up with them again. Mm -hmm. And then that time, though, RV underway. Was gonna was be gonna there. be there with us, so we were gonna do like like a three uh, channel collaboration. <laughs> three <-some. laughs> I was in my brain. I was gonna say we were gonna do a three way, but then I like immediately changed in the middle of my sentence and said we we're gonna do a three channel, Sorry. and then you go we're gonna do a threesome. So I'm like, well, I guess we're doing it. <laughs> we're, we're throwing that out there now. <laughs> it's a family channel, I swear. <laughs> Um, anyway, we're really bummed that yeah. uh, we didn't get to see them, but we are still pretty close to where RV Underway is. So yeah, maybe we'll so be able to still link up with them, kind of depending on how this deal turns. Yeah. But um, if uh, if this thing starts getting better and uh, and you're in, you know, East Central Alabama or 
or West Central Georgia area. <laughs> I'm, I, it's hard to put it to my brain. But if you're in that area, or if you're in the area of Columbus, Georgia, Auburn, Alabama, Fort Benning area, and you want to see us, we'll be here until early May. Yes. So about the next six weeks, we'll mm -hmm. be hanging out here. Uh, this is as close as you'll get to real time because um, we're recording this today and putting it out tomorrow. So um, um, I don't know if we're going to continue doing our weekly updates on the situation. Probably n no need because yeah. we're staying put. Yeah, we were going to do a video every Wednesday and put that out to say this is how it's but impacting our travels. Mm -hmm. And as we're moving along, if anything changes, but it changed so drastically and now seemingly uh, long term yeah. that there's not really going to be enough changes no week to week to do a weekly update. We will still do our, our real time updates over mm -hmm. on, on our Patreon page. So if you're with us on, on Patreon, uh, we'll still be doing those real time updates and those behind the scenes stuff. But we want to kind of get uh, off the weeklies if we don't have to do them, mm -hmm. if nothing changes, and just kind of go back to our, our Sunday normal videos. Because uh, we're ahead a couple of weeks. So. To our regular viewing pleasure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Because on on our Sunday videos, it still looks like we just left Beaumont, but that was a few weeks ago. Yeah. Uh, and it still looks like we're still being able to go in and do stuff, even though stuff's been closed for several weeks, because that's how, how far ahead we are yeah. on YouTube now. Um, so future plans, we are still planning to be here until early May, and then mm -hmm. after that we're going to try to get back on course. Yes. And from here going up to Chattanooga, Chattanooga. and then heading our way up to Niagara Falls, uh, unless something crazy happens. So probably around the time that we're getting ready to be either extended here or leaving here, we might pop on and do a real-time update just to let you know, hey, we're continuing traveling on in the right direction, or hey, we're stuck for X amount longer. <laughs> You know, yeah. Um, we would be curious to see how this is affecting your plans. So leave us a comment. Yeah. Let us know if it's impacted you, how it's impacted you. Do you have enough toilet paper? <laughs> These are all things we are curious about because we care about how it's impacted you, also. Um, and we we were also supposed to meet up with some subscribers. Yeah. Uh, some of our patrons on Patreon. So we're really kind of bummed about that, but. Um, Hopefully we'll get back on track and be able to God, hook back so. up with some people because we miss seeing people. Yeah. We're very peoply people, um, not like big crowds peoply, but we like yeah. to hang out in small, small intimate clusters. crowds yeah. and uh, just hang out. So we want to get back to that because we were meeting up with somebody almost every week. Yeah. And it was just really fun to hang out and learn about them and where they're from, what their yeah. RV plans are going to be for the future. And so now we're just kind of like stuck by ourselves out here in the woods. <laughs> <laughs> but Lauren's close by, so she'll yeah. come hang out and, and we'll go hang out with she her. She's a move yeah. coming up so we can help with She's the move. She's moving from one apartment yeah. to another. So, um, and we'll probably do some RV stuff, uh, some RV videos, uh, stuff we haven't really been able to do because we've been on the move. Mm -hmm. And it's documenting our adventures and our travels. But since we can't really do that now, we'll we'll pop up a couple of videos on stuff that we do in and around the RV, some hacks and tricks and products that we use. And, and get Scout out. Yeah, for sure. He, his, his winter brumation took away his courage to be outside. <laughs> yeah. Everything spooks him again. So <laughs> we, we have to desensitize him to, <laughs> to the sounds again. Yeah. So we'll work on that while we're here. <laughs> yeah, for sure. But uh, so that's it. We are in uh, we're, we're in Alabama now. That was a long trip yesterday. It was, it was a long that was drive. Not fun. I you mean, know, we've driven longer just in a car. Yeah. But but even these past few legs, it's only been an hour, uh, hour and a half, two hours, uh, two and a half tops yeah. to get to the next but, spot, yeah, and then the we'll stay a week or two. And yeah. even the next few were scheduled to be really short. Short trips. And so yesterday was a little brutal for us, kind of like culture shock. Like, hey, guess what? You're gonna drive for almost eight hours. Yeah. Ouch. Yeah. Uh, well, Luckily, there wasn't that much traffic, so yeah, we <laughs> flowed well. <laughs> yeah. It wasn't bad. We had to drive through New Orleans and through Montgomery. Those were the major cities, you, but yeah. uh, traffic wasn't bad wasn't at terrible. all. And it was on a Saturday, so it wasn't, wasn't yeah. too terrible. Um, anyway, I think that's about it for the update, huh? Yeah. Well, we'll let you know if anything drastically changes, and we'll be back to our normally scheduled Sunday programming. <laughs> like we do at the end of all of our videos, we're going to honor a fallen hero. We appreciate you watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.